I'm Tracy with Yoga with Tracy. Are you looking for another 10 minute yoga stretch to get your day started, move the body, warm it up, and just breathe a little bit more deeply? Join me right here. We're gonna start at the top of our mat. Feet are hip width distance apart. We're gonna start with in Tadasana. Feet are planted into the floor, hands are at the heart. Let's take a nice deep breath in through the belly. Let, raise it up to the rib cage, right to the collarbones, and then breathe out. Again, inhaling deeply through the belly, rib cage to the collarbones, and then breathe it all the way out. Inhaling one more time, and then exhale. Okay, arms are gonna come all the way up. Let's reach to the sky, touch the fingertips, and let's dive right onto the toes. Breathe out. Soft bent knees, weight in the heels, a tight belly. Let's come on up to flat back. Breathing in, exhale down to the toes. Come on all the way up. Breathing in, reaching, lengthening, and then exhale, take your hands to the heart. So these are half sun salutations. We're gonna do three more. Inhale, touch the fingers. Exhale, dive to the toes. Breathe out. Inhale the flat back with a tight belly to support the spine. Remember, the back is flat. And then down to the toes. <sighs> Inhale, hinging at the hips, lead with the chest coming all the way up. Exhale, hands to the heart. Want you to focus on breathing and connecting breath with movement. So breathe out, dive to the toes. Inhale the flat back. Exhale to the toes. Come on, all the way up, reach to the sky, lengthen everything out, exhale, hands to the heart. One more time, breathing in, exhale, dive to the toes, breathe out, inhale, flat back, exhale to the toes. Come on, all the way up, lengthen, reaching up, and then exhale, hands to the sides. We're gonna roll the shoulders out for three, two, and one. Now we're gonna take the arms all the way up and let's dive all the way to the toes. <sighs> Hands come down to the mat, spread those fingers and we're gonna step back into our first downward dog. I want you to lift up the hips, walk out the feet, bend the knees. So there's nothing to say that you need to be static in this pose. This is just the beginning of the practice. So we have to warm up the body Find that comfortable stance. Maybe you found it already, so I want you to put the feet hip width distance apart. The knees are bent slightly. The hips, the belly are drawn up. The fingers are pressed into the earth. And the arms are engaged. Okay, come on up on the toes. And then we're going to breathe out. Bring the knees to the mat. And let's melt into child's pose. Breathe out. Balasana. So in this posture, I want you to think about rounding and grounding those hips. Mount those sits bones over the heels. Take a nice breath here. In and out. Now, slowly press yourself up slightly and take the arms gently over to the right side of the mat. Melt, soften. Focus on breathing into the left side of the ribs the left side of the hips. Nice breath here, in and out. Slowly come on back to center and let's go to the other side. Still conscious of those hips being rounded and grounded over those heels. So sit bones over the heels, stretching now to the left side of the mat, breathing into the right rib cage and the right hips. Nice breath here, in and out. Well done. Slow coming back to center and just melt back into this child's pose. Softening into the face, relax the shoulders, breathe in and out. Now gently, slowly come on all the way up and let's get into tabletop. So in tabletop, the shoulders are going to be stuffed right on top of the wrist Hips stuffed on top of the knees, and let's sway from side to side. I'm just kind of gauging how the hips are feeling today. 
and we'll go front and back. Okay, and let's stop at the center, lower the belly, open up the chest for cow pose. Breathe here in, and then exhale, round the back, draw the belly in, chin into chest, press into those hands, cat pose. Again, breathing into cow, exhale to cat. Again, breathing in, cow, exhale to cat. Now come to flat back. Let's set the left foot between the hands. We're going to have the knee right on top of the ankle and the back knee behind the hips. Spread those toes too. We want to really activate all of the body. So right out, right down to those digits. So really spread those toes. And then let's take the left hand on top of the thigh. Draw your belly in and raise the right arm up. Find length here. We're going to hold it for three. Keep on breathing two, and one. Let's take the left arm up, reach and lengthen a little bit more, open up the heart here. Still the belly's drawn in so the back is nice and supported. Inhale, and then exhale, release. Well done. Take the chest up, tuck the toes under, spread those fingers, breathe out, and step back into downward dog. Maybe again, you're still walking out those feet. Feet are hip or distance apart. Fingers are nicely spread. Engage the tops of your arms. And let's try to really open up the chest, widen the back a little bit more. And how about drawing the belly in just a little bit more too. Breathe in here and out. Inhale, come up on the toes. Bring your knees down to the mat. Melt into child's pose. Breathe out. Well done. Let's take the arms over to the right side. So now this is familiar. Stretching more deeply now to the left side of those ribs and the hips. Conscious breath. Come on back to center. Let's go to the other side. How does this side feel? Remember, sits bones are melting over those heels. Stretching to the right side of the rib cage. The right hips. Three. Now come on back to center. Don't forget to breathe. We're going to slowly press ourselves back up to cow. Inhaling here and exhaling to cat. Very good. Come on back to center. Uh, breathing in back to cow. And exhale, cat. Draw the belly in, chin to the chest. One more time. Breathing in. And then exhale. Come to flat back, stepping the right foot between the hands. Very good. Remember, spread those toes, knee on top of the ankle, back knee behind the hips. Right hand's going to come on top of the thigh. Draw the belly in, relax those shoulders, and send that left arm up, holding it here. Breathing for three, two, one. Let's take the right arm up. Keep those arms in the body, so relax those shoulders. Breathing in, opening up the chest a little bit more, drawing the belly in to support the spine, and release, breathe out, well done. Inhale with the chest up, tuck the back toes under, spread those fingers, step back to downward dog. Maybe again, walking it out. And then finding those hips and the backs of the legs right up to the sky. Breathe here. Awesome. Come on up on the toes. Bring your knees down to the mat and then melt back into child's pose. Soften here. Breathe out. One more time. Sending breath into the back of the body. Inhaling and exhaling. And we're going to slowly press yourself up. And I want you to come onto your sits bones, swing the legs around, come on into a gentle seated Sukhasana, easy sitting pose. Okay, so shoulders are going to be stuck right on top of the hips again. Draw the chin in. Sometimes we protrude our necks. So we're going to bring that in and then draw the belly in. Imagine somebody's lifting you at the top of the head with a little string. And let's take the arms all the way up. Breathe in and out. Now, arms up the midline, in 
Exhale, open up the arms, hold it right here. Belly still drawn in, breathe in here. And then exhale, gently twist. Inhale, back to center. Tall spine, exhale, twist. Very good, come on back to center. Breathing in, release the arms, roll the shoulders up. Three, two, and one. Lift the left arm all the way up and let's do a gentle sway. Very good, come on back to center. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, lift and exhale. Let's hold it here. Breathe, relax the shoulder. How about nudging that elbow up? Relax shoulder, looking up gently if the neck allows it. And then exhale, looking down. Let's try that again, breathing in. And exhale, looking down. Okay, come on back up, lift and release. Let's do the other side, breathing in, tall spine. Exhale, sway. Good, come on back up, breathing in, tall spine. Exhale, sway. Inhale, lift, and exhale, sway. Let's just melt and hold it here. Remember to drop this bottom shoulder. Let's nudge that top shoulder um, elbow up. Relax that uh, right shoulder. Look up gently, breathe in, and then exhale, look down. So depending on how the neck feels, maybe you don't do this at all. Otherwise, if it's feeling good, we're gonna look up and down. Let's do one more time. Breathing in and out. Come on back up, lift and release. Okay, shoulder rolls for three, two, and one. Let's switch our feet. Let's take the left hand in front, right hand behind. Lift and lengthen the spine. Inhale here, and then exhale, twist. In this twist, gently relax those hips. So we don't wanna grind those sits bones into that mat. We're just gonna soften those hips. So we're gonna lengthen through the spine as we breathe in. And then exhale, gently twist. Maybe the hand wants to come onto the knee. Inhale, lengthening. And then exhale, twist. With soft, relaxed shoulders and you're staying in this twist, gently look over the opposite shoulder. Hold it here and breathe. Inhaling and exhale. One more time, breathing in and exhale. Now breathe in and then exhale, unwind. Okay, we're gonna do the other side. So this is the right hand in front, left hand behind. Okay, inhale, lengthening. And then exhale, twisting, shoulders are relaxed. Inhale, lengthening. Exhale, twist. Maybe the hand's on the knee. Your choice, your practice. Breathing in. Exhale, twisting, softening into those hips. Now staying in this twist, breathe in, soft shoulders, and then exhale, let's look over the opposite shoulder, relaxing, breathing, softening. Inhaling here, and exhale. Inhaling, exhale. One more time, breathing in, and then on the exhale, we're going to unwind, breathe out. Well done. We're gonna roll the shoulders out for three, two, and one. Well done. Take the arms all the way up. Breathe in, exhale, breathe out. One more time to close our practice. Breathing in, hands together, exhale, hands to the heart. Well done, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your day. Namaste.